Hello, Fast Trackers. Welcome to day six of the seven day new member Fast Track. I hope that you have been following along each day because if you have been following along each day, tomorrow you will finish up your daily doses and you can take your test, pass your test, and earn your first badge. And that'll be very exciting. And I hope to hear from you after you've done that. So today I would like for you to watch this tutorial, but I would also like for you to watch daily doses number 19, 20, 21, and 22, marking yes that you have watched each video as you do that. And then I want you to follow the directions in this tutorial that I'm gonna give to help you use the meal plan generator and make a personalized meal plan. And then I want you to check out the wow challenges. And I would love for you to comment on this uh, post with a wow challenge that would be good for you and then I would also like to for you to comment with a lean protein fiber scarb and fruit meal that you would like to try now keep in mind that in weight loss I mean my personal opinion was to stay away from energy carbs and fruit in the beginning but I'm just kind of teaching you all along about different combinations I did a lot of ones and twos and fours and twos and things like that and meal replacements to lose uh, the weight and by the way I weighed this morning and I am half a pound away from losing 50 pounds so that's very exciting okay so I'm going to share my screen with you and show you how to make a meal plan and show you where the wow challenges are I'm actually going to show you the wow challenges first so these wow, okay, I went to uh, wall breakers and challenges, this orange tab right here, and then I click on wow challenge meal plans. You click right there, and they added a favorites tab recently, which is fantastic because now when I find a wow challenge that I like, I can just favorite it, and my personal favorites are in there. So we're going to scroll down and I am going to look for a wow challenge that I think sounds good to me. And um, some of these are named after me. This one's named after me. This Kim's Cheesy Challenge, that one's named after me. And this Kim's Egg White Grill Challenge is named after me. So that's kind of fun. Um, let's look at this. Let's look at this Cheese Dip Challenge. That sounds good. All right, so once we look at a wow challenge, it says for breakfast, one scrambled egg with two tablespoons of cheese dip on the egg. That sounds good. Now these are funny, these are odd, but they are designed to help you lose up to a pound a day. And if it's got somebody's name on it, like this is Jessica, uh, I don't know who Jessica is, but hey Jessica, if you're listening, I don't know who Jessica is, but she has asked Travis to make a wow challenge based on some things that she likes to eat. So for lunch, you can have bell peppers, carrots, or celery with up to a quarter of a cup of cheese dip. And then for dinner, approved chips with two ounces of 96% lean ground meat and up to a quarter cup of cheese dip. Salsa is also fine. And it says, please use one of the approved chips, health wise chips, double bites, or bonitos. No snacks are allowed, no freebies are allowed. You can always have a zero calorie beverage. Condiments, as long as they're zero calorie or near zero calorie. There's no exercise required. You can do whatever supplements you normally do. And let's see, it says at this time, use only this approved cheese dip. Okay, so, so the see how it's very specific, but actually I think all that sounds pretty good. So I am going to heart that. And if I wanted to accept it, and, and do it on a certain date, I would click accept right there, okay? So just look through the wow challenges and find the ones you like and heart them. That way, when you go right here to my favorites and you've got some of these hearted, so I'm gonna click on there. And look, three people have also said that they like that one too, which is great. You can go back and revisit very quickly your favorites. So I've been through and read most of them before. But those are fun, they'll help you break a plateau, or maybe you just want somebody else to come up with your meal plans for you. Now, once you've accepted the challenge though, you have to do the challenge, otherwise you get a, a diet devil badge, and then you have to do another one to get rid of that badge. 
Okay, so now we're gonna talk about generating a meal plan. Yesterday, I'm hoping that you played around with the um, food library and the recipe library and all of those things. And I hope you made a list of 10 fibrous carbs that you liked and 10 lean proteins that you liked. But now I'm gonna show you how to maybe get some other ideas with a meal plan. So if you click right here on home and scroll down just a little bit, right here, see this area, see it's meal plans. You can click here to generate your own meal ideas. So click there and then you can set up a, a date. So I'm gonna click right there. And then it says that you can have a meal plan generated on simple ideas based on recipes only or mixed. It would give you both. So just for the fun of it, because I usually pick mixed, I'm gonna click simple and I'm gonna hit generate. And it's telling me I already have a meal plan for that week. Well, that's because I play around with this a lot, showing people how to do it. And so I'm just gonna pick a new week. There we go. And so it's given me a bunch of simple meal plans. So I could have an Egg McMuffin on a Thomas Light Muffin. I could use a whole egg in category one, Smithfield Canadian bacon or deli ham, or you could use egg whites and a Jimmy Dean turkey sausage patty. Either way, they go on a Thomas English muffin to make a perfect four plus two breakfast. So that's a protein plus fat and fibrous carb breakfast. And there is very specifically the shopping list that you would need to do that. Or you could have a healthy choice power bowl, turkey sausage and egg scramble, and you can have one as a meal. Check the library for other approved frozen meal options. And there's your little grocery list. Power Crunch Protein Energy Bar with HealthWise High Protein Hot Chocolate. You may have one Power Crunch Bar and one package of HealthWise Hot Chocolate as a meal replacement. HealthWise Hot Chocolate and Power Crunch Bars are both available for purchase at the Shibboleth store, and Power Crunch Bars are available at your local grocery stores. So there's that. So if you like all of those, you can just leave them all checked, okay? So I'm gonna uncheck this one just because I'm gonna show you what it does when you uncheck something. For lunch, you can have AHS fettuccine, one package with two to three ounces of tuna. You may have one package of AHS fettuccine with two to three ounces of lean protein like tuna as a coach mode meal. AAH, AHS products are available for purchase at our Shibboleth store. And there's those two right there. If you are listening to this and you are not near one of the Shibboleth stores, just order online. After you order $30, they ship it to you for free. Approved chicken salad with bran crisp bread. Mm, that sounds good. So it tells you that you can have an approved chicken salad of any of the approved recipes and the resources or use up to one cup diced or shredded chicken breast, up to 50 calories of fat-free or light mayo. It says light mayo is much higher in calories so you may be only able to use one tablespoon of it. And zero calorie salad cube pickles or relish. You may have up to four slices of bran crisp bread. Bran crisp bread is available at the Shibola store. And the recipes and resources have different weight loss meters based on the ingredients. So your weight loss meter for this meal, if you choose a recipe, would be whatever the weight loss meter is for that recipe. So they kind of give you some grocery list right there. And then if you wanted to have a turkey spam sandwich, you could do that. My goodness, they give you everything, don't they? So I'm just gonna unclick the turkey spam sandwich. And then I'm gonna kind of skim through these, but a crawfish tail salad. I'm not gonna eat that because I don't eat crawfish. Chicken, uh, grilled chicken and salad greens, that sounds great. Sandwich Brothers Chicken Melts Flatbread Chicken Sandwich, that sounds great. Let's look at these snacks. Choco Rite Sugar-Free Milk Chocolate Pecan Clusters, I do really like those. Coco Ringa, there's that. A real good snack size pizzas, any flavor. I'm gonna leave all those marked. And then freebies, fried rice and lo mein void replacements. So that would be interesting. You'd have to read that and see if you like that. There's you got your dill pickles checked if you like those. Raw cucumber or cucumber sprinkled with apple cider vinegar, salt and pepper. So 
I'm going to uncheck everything down here just to show you how they generate something else. I was looking for something. Okay. So let's go back up here and you're going to click generate new items. And let's see. So it gave me a Kashi Go Lean Crunch with Kroger Carb Master, Fat Free Fair Life, or Egg Whites International as your liquid. I'm going to leave that there. And then I left all the lunches there before. And in the dinners, let's see. Yeah, I took off one up here, but now it's giving me Chick fil A grilled nuggets with or without a side salad. It tells you exactly what you need to do to make that approved. And then I kept all the snacks the same a few minutes ago. And now for the freebies, it's told me I could have some sauteed yellow squash if I wanted it. Now, one thing that I'd like for you to do is if you're having a freebie squash, if you're having any category two vegetable as a freebie, just eat it raw and not in cooked in oil, because that right there changes it. It's really not a freebie. Okay, so please cook them and eat them raw. You can have steamed broccoli as a freebie, and you can have sugar-free jello. So just for the heck of it, I'm gonna leave all those there, but you can see how you could just generate meal plan after meal plan after meal plan and have the thinking done for you. So I'm gonna click confirm. And then just, I'm gonna show you what it would look like if I clicked print. So I'm gonna click print. And if I wanted to, I can just print it. That gives me my grocery list and it gives me my meal plan all together on one piece of paper that I can have laying right on my counter. So I hope that you now know how to look at wow challenges and that you know how to generate a meal plan. I know we can come up with things all on our own, but sometimes it's good just to see these options and add to your choice for food. So I hope you are having a great day. I hope you're having a great week. Please let me hear from you. And I would love to know how you're doing. And on Saturday, you should be able to take your test and earn your first badge. I'll talk to you later. Bye.